We almost discovered a new hack. Can you make me a cup of tea? Oh my god, it looks so strange. Hello everyone, today we are making a 1930s inspired makeup and I have one right here and this one will be the one we will be doing today. It seems like in this period eyebrows were like super thin and uh, almost like you almost can't see them and uh, like the signature of this period was red lip and I can see like some eyeshadow here and uh, in this photo it's not like in the in the others that I saw but here it's a little bit contour right here but in other photos I saw like a lot of blush like here and here like everywhere so this will be the inspiration for today so let's do it so we are going to start with a little bit of cream I tried to do like my hair but I don't think I did it great but it's my first time doing this thing so forgive me for not having like that perfect hair that they did in those times it's really nice to just like take a break for all the trends that are going on right now and just experiment what women were doing in 90s so I want to say that we are starting with this foundation that is it's not really white but um, I will fix it with something so I started watching a lot more like videos from Nikki tutorials and I honestly watched her videos like previously and I love her makeups I I'm obsessed with her makeups and I saw on some video that she made like a 1930 makeup and I started to think that I want to make a series with this like 1930 and 1970 and I don't know which years I will do but it will be a series with different makeups and it will be honestly super interesting like I watched her video so many times before I started this one she's just amazing like she she's really 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 good at what she does honestly this is the only thing that I hate from that period that they were doing such thin eyebrows that almost you can you cannot see like they looked exactly like someone would just take a paper and would make like a line with a crayon I even dressed like a 1930 look yeah I, I wanted to try that trend and I shaved my brows till here and I was making like um, that line to be just straight and I, I, I can't say much more than I started to hate myself that one day so my boyfriend came up with a great idea to use some glue that is water-based and it will come off really easily we almost discovered a new hack so let's start to put foundation on here again like for the third time oh my god so my neighbors are going like uh, outside and they are making a lot of noise again oh my god it looks so strange so let me look a little bit for the brows that i will have in some seconds i i feel like i i will cry but let's try to make this happen i would never do my eyebrows like this honestly oh my god this looks so bad how these girls were like pulling this off I mean some were, were actually looking good with these eyebrows <laughs> oh my god now that we have uh, something because I can't name them as brows I don't know I feel like I just like let some type of kid just draw my face right now it's something with a little bit of brown it has some sort of eyeliner but not really this makeup is strange I can't wait to get to like the 60s makeup because that is my favorite one from the one that I chose to just inspire from but that one is like uh, the one that really really caught my eye and actually I think it it will really look pretty I will go and drink a tea with this makeup and people will look like um, oh my god 1930s are back and they will say yes they are and after that, 
I hope these pearls are not coming back. But I wouldn't stand to wear these. Let's put some here. My hand did anything. And I will try to make these lashes to stay much more better. Why are women so strange? Oh no. Why it's, it's like happening to me again, 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 and again, and again, and again. Why I always poke, poke my eye with mascara? We will go with the blush and um, this will change the look because I will be like a strawberry, like really, really pink here. And they were like putting all of this like everywhere. It looks a little bit strange for me, but um, oh my God. I'm already feeling like a clown. And now the best part, the red lips. This is the only thing that I like about this makeup. So one thing that I noticed in that photo was that they were like overdoing the lip a little bit, just a little bit. I'm such a beauty, right? I look like a 1930 person now. And with all of this hair that is not great and these beautiful brows that are almost slipping off like almost they are trying to just <laughs> like they are trying to fly a little bit somewhere maybe in the 1930s because they are they are a little bit hated right now and and I'm sure they feel this So guys, this is the makeup, we are done and we are in the period of 1930s right now. So if you like this type of videos, I invite you to give this video a like, subscribe, touch that notification button, bell, and stay on the channel because we'll make a series with these makeups. So bye! <laughs>